Hello guys, welcome back to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we'll be taking a look at an altcoin XRP quietly trading for $0.35. When will XRP pump to the moon? Should we keep holding XRP through the bear market? Guys, in 2017, we saw XRP pump really hard from as low as $0.005. It went as high as $3.5, more than a 66,000% increase. But since then, we have not seen XRP pump really well to the moon since then. We have seen XRP dump. XRP has actually lost more than 96% from that all-time high we set in 2018. We had a 2021 bull run XRP pump, but it didn't pump like the rest of the market. Is the time right for XRP to start pumping? In this video, we'll be taking a look at the XRP US dollar price chart, we'll taking a look at XRP's performance against Bitcoin, XRP performance against Ethereum, and then we'll also look at XRP's market cap. It's currently sitting at a very, very crucial support level. If we can hold this level, maybe just maybe there's hope for us to pump to new highs. We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, if you're new to this channel and you want to make money long term trading or investing in cryptocurrencies, this is the channel for you. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notification if you want to get notified anytime I drop a new video. Let's get down to business. Guys, at the point of recording this video, we're having a very green day in the crypto market. But XRP is up. 5.4% in the last 24 hours. In the last one week, it's up 4.8%. In the last one month, it's down 4.3%. And the big one, in the last one year, XRP is down 68.4%. Should we start buying some XRP right now in the bear market? Or will XRP continue dumping lower? XRP has hit a very, very crucial support level. We want this level to hold. This has been a very, very important level for XRP over the years. Below this level, XRP is very, very bearish. Above this level, XRP is very, very bullish. And right now, we are the cops of deciding, are we going to go down or are we going to go up? We saw XRP get to as high as $1.96 at the top of the bull run in 2021. Since then, XRP has been dumping. XRP has lost more than 84% of its value since then. XRP dropped to as low as $0.29. Should we start accumulating some XRP? History has shown that this level where we are right now has been a very, very good accumulation region for XRP. Look at what happened in 2017. XRP got to the $0.36 level. What happened? It got stopped out there. We had to consolidate below that level. And if you bought XRP around this region, you got to enjoy the one final pump XRP had to the upside. XRP in just 35 days went up more than 1,396 days. Now, the thing with XRP is that it doesn't pump a lot, but when it pumps, it goes up very, very quickly. And after that pump, there will be a long time of consolidation. In 2017, XRP had three different pumps and totally XRP went up more than 700 times in 2017 entering 2018. If you just invested $1,000 in XRP right here, you got to cash out more than $700,000 at the top. That's the kind of profit you can get with XRP. But as XRP got bigger and bigger, the profit got smaller and smaller. In the 2021 bull run from the COVID lows we had right here at 12 cents for XRP, we saw XRP went to as high as $1.9, more than a 1,400% increase. That means if you invested $1,000 in XRP right here, you got more than $14,000 if you sold right here. Right now, an argument can be made that XRP is accumulating. A lot of big players are accumulating XRP at this lows. Maybe, just maybe, we'll start pumping. If the XRP pumps from where we are right now, pumps to the previous all-time high, guys, that's more than a 1,000% increase on your investment. Now, will this happen in the bear market? I don't think it will happen in the bear market. History has shown us that all the other times XRP was pumping crazy to the moon was the period in time where the market was in easy mood when Bitcoin was pumping. All the times we've seen XRP pump. So if XRP is going to start pumping that kind of crazy pump, we will expect to see Bitcoin pumping maybe to new all-time highs, maybe to around 40, 50K. If not, we are still in the bear market and history has shown that in the previous bear market, XRP ranges with the market. So when the market is dumping, XRP dumps to the market. 
spot when the market is pumping, XRP pumps to the market. From the all-time high we set in 2018 January, guys, we saw XRP lose more than 96% of its value in the bear market. It took it more than 800 days before it finally bottomed. And then the market started pumping and XRP pumped to the market. Even though the SEC sued Ripple, we had a dent right here. XRP couldn't go to break into new all-time highs. We were shy of the previous all-time high. The previous all-time high for XRP was around the $3.7, $3.8 region. I believe XRP will get to $10 one day. But we have to ask ourselves, how is XRP performing against Bitcoin and Ethereum? If you want to be holding XRP through the bear market, you want to make sure you are holding a cryptocurrency that can stand the test of time. If you take a look at XRP's performance against Bitcoin, when the market is in easy mode, you want to have some XRP. That's when XRP stars are performing Bitcoin. We have the three different times that XRP outperformed Bitcoin by a lot. We had XRP outperforming Bitcoin from June 2014 till December 2014. Guess what was happening then, guys? Bitcoin was pumping, the market was in easy mode, XRP went up over 1,900% against Bitcoin. In 2017, we had two bull runs. The first bull run, XRP went up more than 4,800% against Bitcoin in just 91 days. And then we had a little dump, and then we had another phase of the bull run where XRP went up more than 1,800% in just 46 days. So anytime XRP is pumping to the upside, it's very, very swift and very, very violent to the upside. So I expect at some point in time, we see XRP pumping to the upside. Now, a lot of people might ask, how is this possible when recession, yada, yada, yada. Guys, the SEC sued Ripple. If that lawsuit gets settled, I believe the Ripple effect is going to affect the whole crypto market. XRP, especially, we're going to see XRP pump to outrageous amounts because a lot of people will start forming. That's just how the market rolls. And if people start forming into XRP with their Bitcoin, guess what they will do with their Ethereum? The same thing. Now, Ethereum was launched right here in 2015. XRP has been one of the OG coins. XRP has been in the market way, way before Ethereum. XRP has been in the market since 2013. When Ethereum was launched in 2015, XRP started losing value against Ethereum because Ethereum started pumping to outrageous price valuations. We saw XRP lose more than 99% of its value against Ethereum after Ethereum was launched. Now, XRP tried to recover. We saw XRP pump against Ethereum. It gained value against Ethereum, but it couldn't go to set new all-time highs so xrp gained more than three thousand percent against ethereum but xrp was not able to set new all-time highs now since december 2018 xrp has been dumping really hard against ethereum xrp has lost more than 94 percent of its value against ethereum is history repeating itself guys the first time we saw xrp lose so much value against ethereum right here it lost 99 percent of its value against ethereum xrp pump more than three thousand percent Right now, XRP has lost more than 94% of its value against Ethereum. How high do you think it's going to pump? I'm not insinuating that XRP is going to pump to new all-time highs against Ethereum. I'm just telling you that I won't be surprised to see XRP have a huge, huge pump against Ethereum. I won't be surprised to see XRP outperforming Ethereum in the nearest future. For eventually, the lawsuit gets settled. You see people throwing their Bitcoin and throwing their Ethereum into some XRP. They want some sweet, sweet gains. Guys, in the last one month, we've seen XRP go to as high as $0.39 and as low as $0.31. Currently, XRP has a market cap of $17.3 billion, a fully directed market cap of $34 billion, and we have over 49.6 billion XRP in circulation out of a maximum 100 billion tokens. XRP is ranked number seven on coin market cap. We have 1.6 million people that have XRP on their watch list. Now, where can you get some XRP if you want to buy some and hold through the bear market? You can get some XRP on Binance, on FTX, on Bitstamp, Qcoin, and anywhere you get your favorite altcoins. XRP is very, very popular. Guys, altcoin season index is showing us when all season. This is another important metric we want to be watching out for. The last two times to flash all season, XRP pump in those period in time will xrp pump right now or will xrp dump the rest of the market is the pump over these are questions we need answers to bitcoin dominance is actually dumping and history has shown that anytime bitcoin dominance is dumping that has been a good sign for the altcoin market but we need that catalyst we need that team that will pump the market so that xrp will start going on that huge huge bull run the crypto market is still in extreme fear so a lot of people are not buying any coins right now even though the altcoin season index is showing us why in all season Drop your thoughts in the comment section. Do you think XRP will pump very, very soon? Do you think the lawsuit will soon be settled? Because the chat is telling us that maybe, just maybe, there's something around the corner. Because if XRP falls below this level, then we're going to Goblin Town. We're going straight to the COVID lows. That's another strong, strong support XRP has. If XRP gets to 13 cents, I'll just be loading my bag. But right now, it looks as if 
XRP's movement favors the upside. I want to hear your thoughts about that in the comment section. Guys, if you take a look at XRP market cap, it's currently at a very, very crucial level. It's currently at the $17 billion level. Uh, above this level, XRP is bullish. And if we get below this level, this will be a very, very good accumulation region. That's XRP market cap comes below $15 billion to the $8 billion level. This will be a good place to accumulate XRP. You can see that the bulk of the previous bear market was spent around $15 billion to around $8.5 billion level. So I believe that XRP might not get to this level, but if XRP gets to this level, it's the same as just buying XRP in the previous bear market. But XRP's chart looks very, very bullish because it looks as if we are gearing up for a very, very big move. All coins have been pumping, but I've not seen XRP pump like the rest of the all coins. Do you think XRP will still pump in this bear market or is the relief rally over for XRP? Will you be buying more XRP? Will you be holding your XRP through the bear market or will you be selling your stash expecting lower prices? I want to hear your thoughts about that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this. Turn on the post notifications to get notified anytime I drop a new video. See you guys in my next video. Seven, one.